let me pray for you for healing. I want to pray for you. Okay. Thank you hear me? I want to pray for you so that God must heal you. Okay, thanks. Oh, you hear me? Amen. So I believe because this sickness is affecting your house now. Yeah. Huh? It's affecting your bedroom, affecting everything. Amen. So, but by the grace of God, today you'll be healed. Amen. Oh, you hear me? Amen. Because the whole of your blood now is changing. Amen. It's changing color. But God has healed you of this high blood and sugar diabetes. Come out! In Jesus' mighty name. Daniel Mashimse, I'm from Kempton Park, but from Guyana originally, but I'm staying in Kempton Park. And can you tell us the prophecy you received today and also confirm it? The prophecy is about a, a disease that I, I, don't, I didn't know it is, it is living in my body now, but the symptoms were there because I, some, some years ago I suffered the same, that is high blood and uh, I didn't know that I've got sugar, sugar diabetes, but it's, it's talking that in my blood is changing now towards that. So I actually uh, got that confirming that prophecy. And yeah, that is affecting my, uh, my uh, marriage in terms of uh, uh, my bad life here. Yeah. Thanks. And, and, and for how long has this been happening and how was it affecting you? Uh, well, uh, I started feeling something strange in my body last w last week, and uh, yeah, spitting blood. Uh, that those are the symptoms of high blood, uh, and so I didn't know of uh, sugar diabetes. I don't know. I don't know the symptoms, but I started feeling something unusual. Uh, yeah. And when you saw the blood coming out, did you go to the hospital to find out what is happening with you? No, I didn't. I, I took it like it's something that will... I thought maybe I ate some a fish or something just spiked my mouth and it's something that will heal. Uh, so I didn't, sus I didn't suspect anything of high blood or sugar diabetes. No. And when the man of God located you, how did you feel? No, I feel great and... Uh, because uh, always uh, anything that the devil is trying to attack my life, then it goes away once men of God locate me. I know that, that, that there is a solution already. Yeah, once men of God locate me, I know a solution came to my life. There is no way God can locate me and no solution comes. So that's, I was happy and I'm happy about that. Yeah. I want to pray for you. I want to pray for you. Yes. Huh? Yep. You know why I say I want to pray for you? I don't know. You don't know? Yes. <laughs> you don't know? I don't know. Should I tell you? Yes. <laughs> I want to pray for you because, you know, the devil is bringing threats about your health. Yes. Yes. Huh? Yes. Now you understand now. I understand. Huh? Yes. You are never booked for operation? Um, no, not yet. Not yet? Yes. But you wanted to? Uh, I had some pains, some stomach pains. And I, I went to the doctor twice. Yeah. Listen, this thing here is going down now. Okay. Are oh, you hearing me? Yes. This thing wants to hold you. Yes. <laughs> it wants to hold you somewhere. Huh? Yes. We've got older people here. There was a time I was calling a person who... Sometimes if I call you, if you don't come, it's not like I don't know you. I'll leave you so that your faith must grow. Listen, I'll pray for you. Yes. God will heal you today. Amen. Amen. Are you hearing me? Yes. I'm saying God will heal you when? Today. Today. Yes. And this
increase opportunities of business also. Yes. Huh? Yes. Also marriage. Yes. Jesus name. You're free. Let's see here. Can you confirm? Yeah. Uh, actually, I had, I've had some problems with my health, uh, especially in the stomach. There's some pain coming from one side of my stomach. So I visited the doctor twice and I got some medication. But it was not yet, it's not yet, it was not yet clear until today I got prayed for. Then uh, there's also some pain at, at my ankle. That pain, I can say, it was starting to come up again. And as the prophet prayed for me, uh, I believe it's gone. Then issues of business. Uh, there's a small business that we run. At the, at the house it was not doing well I believe that it's going to be well and there are some other businesses that I'm looking forward to open I'm sure this is the right time now for the businesses Amen, Amen, yes. Amen, Amen Every time there's something here in the stomach huh? So there's something that is turning in the stomach Yes huh? Huh? That's stupid. And this thing is making you suffer now Hmm? It's changing the whole of your blood system. That's true, man. Hmm? So I want to tell you today, God is healing you. Oh yes, on my birthday. Ah! Oh! 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 Thank you, Jesus. Oh, you know, man. God is healing you. Oh. I want to pray. There's someone called. Uh, oh. I'm, I'm hearing his surname called Mafasi. Oh, she's going to go cancer. Oh. Huh? Why you brought her here? Why you brought her here? Yes. Huh? Yes. So you, you didn't want me to bring her here? We had plans for her birthday, man. Huh? So you wanted, had, to, kill, you wanted had, to kill her today? Yes! Yes! Oh, you yes, failed. Yes, yes, yes! You failed. It was her last day today of living, man. Huh? Should he have, should she have not come to church? It was her last day of living. Of living. You hear me? Ooh, wanted to kill her today. Wanted to kill her on her birthday. <gasps> so this thing that you put here, like an animal here in the stomach. Yes. Huh? Yes. Is to kill her. Was to kill her today. <laughs> Why you making her so strong, you? Why you make her so strong? Come on, demon. Come she knew that she was going to be delivered. She knew that Come she was going to be rescued. Come on, you demon. Oh, we have failed. Oh, we have failed. Oh, we have failed. Come on. In Jesus' name, you're free. So, what is your story? My name is Nyele Dimabanyisi. I come from Guyani and currently I'm staying in Pretoria. And can you confirm the prophecy you received today? Yes, I confirm the prophecy to be true. Um, you know, for me to find myself in church today is a miracle and it's the best, best, best birthday present ever. Uh, he told me that um, there's something that is moving in my stomach 
and it's affecting my blood and it's something that um, I've experienced late, uh, uh, recently. I could tell that my system is not okay but through Christ who strengthens me I knew that everything is is done as in like today it's my day. So um, I praise God for that. I, I'm so happy. So how was this moving object affecting you? Yo, it was affecting me in such a way that when I bend, I would feel this big pain on my back. And even when I'm, I'm, I'm moving or I'm going, I would feel that there's something like, you know, something that is moving around my tummy. And it was affecting me in such a manner that I was asking myself, like, what's going on? Yeah, so, but this pain... Yo, I, 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 I can't feel it anymore. It's gone completely. And for how long have you been experiencing it? Um, not long. Early this year. Yeah, early this year. Mm. And how are you feeling now, now that they've located you and also prayed for you? I'm the happiest, happiest birthday girl ever. And yeah, I'll keep on believing in God. I'll keep on honoring God. I'll keep on, you know, I'll, I'll keep on doing his works. For I know his works, they mean a lot. And they bring joy, peace and happiness in my life. Mm, amen. Tell you something. Amen. Because of what the devil has been doing, you are the first one to try to follow God now. It's true. And the whole of your family, it's like now you're becoming a threat to Satan. It's true. So let's pray to cancel this issue of sickness because. They have killed your sister. Now they are making your sister sick. If this one dies now, it means they will come to you. Yeah, because it's the two of us that are left. That's why I'm saying, if, because the first one died. Yes. Now the second one is sick. Yes. If she die, where are they going? It means they are coming to you. Yes. But I want to tell you, because you are holding God like this, Amen. There's no one, because when you sleep, you've got so many bad dreams. It's true. Huh? It's true. I'm seeing so many bad dreams to you. Who's using water? Water? Uh-huh. Your neighbor at home. Oh, yeah. Huh? Yes. She goes to another church. That we can't mention. Yes. Because I'm seeing your neighbor. Whoever, I want to say it to you. Whoever. Amen. Whoever that will try anything from now on. Amen. In your family. Amen. I reverse that case. Amen. Are you hearing me? Yes. I reverse that case. Amen. Because now, even marriage now is a problem. For sake. For sake. Huh? For sake. For sake. Papa. Too much. Huh? Oh, Papa, yo. Yes. So why are you witching these people? Why oh, Papa so? Huh? Why oh, Papa so? Yeah, Papa. You're wasting my time. You're wasting my time. You're wasting my time. We are wasting our time as well. I'm wasting your time. Yeah, yeah. Huh? Hey. So why are you witching this whole family, killing people like this? 
Harinya ke selo sela samu venda ka kwa. Aona bana venda. Aona aona bana venda na. Aona ngi? Aona bana venda na. Aona bana. A to nyalo kwa rena. Hai wena. Come on. Sato ba bulai. Sato ba bulai. Rata wona. Come out you demon. Yes. Huh? Yes. 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 Sis, no turu bu chaka linyalo. Kima nga sala nyalo. Kima angi. Kanwe na watseba. One. Watseba kudu ya kere kima angi. Two. O sala nyalo. Kana kakwa. Shit. Live it. Live it. In Jesus' name. I want to pray for you. Amen. Are you hearing me? Yes. What was the prophecy? Can you confirm? Okay. The prophet told me that somebody died and the other one is sick. So it's very true because we were six and four of my sisters died. Now it's only me and my sister who are left, and she's also sick. And then, uh, what, can you continue confirming? And he also uh, told me about the struggle of getting married and my family, which is very true. There's no one who has ever been married. Are you confirming that everything is true? Yes, it's very true, Daddy. I heard that if this one is can die, this thing is coming to you. Were you aware? Yeah, I was aware because I remember when I first came to church, I was scared. When I first came to church, I was scared because I felt like this death is just after me. So it means today is cancer. Amen. Yeah. As a brother, they, they the back then. They wearing a scotch suit. I'm seeing you attending something, yeah. and I'm seeing, I don't know, I don't know you, I'm seeing you attending something like a seminar. Amen. Huh? Amen. Is it true or false? It's true. Wait. I'm seeing you attending a seminar, and I'm seeing someone talking. Amen. And whatever that is, ish, Can I say it? Say it. I want to pray for you. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. Because there's a lot that God wants to do in your life. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. You have been praying, but I'm seeing your life is caged like this. Yeah, that's true. And did you go to Santin? Yes, I once went to Santin. Ah. foundation of cherries there's no one that will shake it amen that's true you hear me i hear you i'm speaking with you because i love you as my brother amen and i want god to, because there's also opportunities of business that are coming amen that's true amen. you hear me amen because you've been trying to do those things yes huh that's true i'm seeing trying to do business yes i'm trying to do but business. i'm seeing someone calling himself a prophet saying something but you have been waiting Amen. I pray for you because what you were told is like there's still a delay. Yes. Oh, you hear me? Yes. But I'm, I'm, not, I'm not speaking against anyone. Yes. I just want to tell you that from here, Amen. Let's see. Amen. If, if God won't, won't do 
what is supposed to do in your life. Amen. I receive it. Amen. I receive it. Mm. Oh, you hear me? Amen, man. Because I'm seeing holding a file. Yes. Huh? Yes. I'm seeing holding a file. Yes. Sitting like this. Yes. <laughs> uh, Amen. Mm. And because you people, you promised. I mean, me and you. I'm, I'm sure I'm seeing for the first time. You, you people, you've been promised a lot of things. And. With the grace of my father who's sitting there. Amen. Let me speak unto your life today. Amen. There's a breakthrough of business that is coming. Amen. Come out, you demon. Bring him here. Confirm the prophecy. They told me that the, there was a seminar that I attended somewhere and there was a conspiracy that was said. Yes, it's true. But of which I did not take any of them because of the revelation I know about the church. So, the man of God also said that the foundation of Charis will not be shaken. Of which I know where does that statement come from. Yes, which the foundation has been laid and the foundation is Jesus Christ. But then I know that uh, along the way, and what also has been said, trying to conspire and date the name of the church, I know. But I won't say many things, but whatever the man of God has said is true. And then also the issue of business. Yes, I confirm it to be true because I've been trying to sell cars, left and right selling cars. And Congratu then, congratulations. I think we can hear that uh, you're confirming it right. God bless you.